Welcome to Fighting Stats, the ultimate channel for MMA fans who love statistics and betting breakdowns. I'm your host, Art C, and I'm here to get you ready for the upcoming UFC fights. In this series, I'll be watching tape and providing my real-time analysis on how I think the fights are going to go. I'll be watching for fighters' strengths, weaknesses, tendencies, and overall strategies, pairing that with Fighting Stats' exclusive UFC stats not available anywhere else to give you a prediction on how I think the fights are going to go and, ultimately, who's going to win. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Welcome to Fighting Stats. Welcome back to Fighting Stats. I'm your host, Art CNT. We are continuing on with Amanda Lemos. Today she takes on Montserrat Conejo. Conejo. Uh, this is a star, rate, uh, star weight belt. Uh, Lemos is going to have 4 inches of height advantage, 4 inches of reach advantage, the minus 550 favorite. Uh, if you were with us in that last fight, uh, we saw Lemos take on Lavinia Souza, winning in the first round by knockout. Uh, dropped her with a straight right, uh, got back up and dropped her with a jab. So very fast hands on display. Uh, we're going to see how this fight played out here. So uh, big underdog here uh, is Conjejo or Kanjiho uh, at plus 400. Again, uh, Lemos minus 550. So odds makers definitely think that Lemos should win this fight. Let's see what happens. 9 1 and 1 coming in. All right, this is going to be the smaller cage, uh, so worth noting. Um, Lemos, mostly the striker, probably wants the bigger cage, but uh, let's see here. All right, they are off. Lemos takes Orthodox, Kandejo takes uh, Southpaw. Goes to the kick to the body right away from Lemos. She has such a hard right kick uh, that the Southpaw, you see, okay, so Lemos backing up here, striking with, oh, 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 okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So right away she opens with this uh, body kick, boom, big hard body kick. Kandejo comes forward, um, throws a left jab on the counter, throws the right hand on the counter there, mo moving backwards, throw a right uh, high kick, another right hand there. Lemos landing early and often, 20 seconds into the fight. Lemos goes high. Conejo, oh, oh nice counter right, oh, no follow up needed. Kanyoni stopped the fight. Another kind of quick stoppage there, but very nice. Very nice pull counter right hand, I think. Here, watch the uh, replay. Okay, hold on. Here's the re replay here. Comes forward, pops a right hand there, stuns her. Comes over with the left hand, drops her. And then Kanyoni with the, uh, the pretty quick stoppage here. Left, right hand. That was quick. You see how she moved back? Popped that right hand right away. Left hand again. Didn't even let uh, her opponent get close. She was uh, throwing counter. So, uh, very nice work. That's two in a row. Two TKO round one wins in a row. Uh, very fast hands. She's shown here that she can strike uh, while moving backwards. We saw in the Souza fight before that that she does like to keep the distance between her and her opponent. So, when her opponent moves forward, uh, she moves backwards. And now we can see that she can strike off of her back foot, uh, throwing some nice counters uh, as well. So, definitely some power in those hands. Uh, very fast hands, uh, nice hard outside low kicks. So uh, some of the striking tools on display, we haven't seen much of a ground game and we haven't really seen it go uh, very extended yet. So we're, we're going to see if we can keep watching the fight tape, uh, fill in those uh, pieces of the puzzle there and then get you a prediction. Again, my name is Artsy and this is Fighting Stats. Thanks for watching. Well, that is it for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this type of content, make sure you smash the like button. Hit the subscribe. Uh, you'll get notified anytime we put out new content. Listen to this. We just hit a massive parlay for $29,000 at UFC 297. That is one UFC after 296 where we hit a parlay for $82,000. That's back-to-back -back parlays. We've made $110,000. And how do we do it? We use our exclusive fighting stats. 
not available anywhere else. Our exclusive fighting stats gives us information, gives us a big edge over the sports books and tell us what's going to happen within the fights. We post all that information, our breakdowns, our best bets over at patreon.com slash fighting stats. Don't miss out. Make sure you subscribe today. Again, my name is Art C. This is Fighting Stats. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.